Welcome to this edition of Rock's Kitchen. I'm Rock, your host. Listen, VSG, cooking is what I'm all about. VSG, vertical sleeve gastrectomy. Better known out there as weight loss surgeries to some people. Now, there are hundreds upon hundreds of thousands of people who've had this procedure. And let me tell you, there's some who choose to be quiet. There's some who choose to be very loud and boisterous. But I've met someone who matches my intensity. I think she even exceeds my, uh, uh, my energy. She is awesome. I met her a couple weeks ago, and when I tell you energy, well, let me not delay this any longer. I have a very special guest here at the kitchen. I can't believe she's here at the kitchen. So, without any further ado, the multi-talented, the plus-size supermodel, beauty of the year, millennium, the, the world, Miss Rosie McCarthy. Ah, uh, I love that presentation. I'm going to go to your kitchen a lot more often. <laughs> Thank you so much for the invite. I'm super excited, number one, to be in New York. Number two, to have met you and how everything's just come together. It's just like a plan that was destined to happen. And it just, you know, when it's meant to be, just everything flows. But I love your message. I love how brave you were. You stood up, you went after what you wanted, you asked for what you needed. And it's like everything came together. And I love what we're going to prepare today because what did I tell you that I loved at the conference? I love, 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 love. I'm, I'm a Garfield, so I'm a lasagna. You, you're a Ninja Turtle, so yeah, you kind of love that pizza, I love right? pizza. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're, we're going to start with the, the ground chicken. It's very, very simple, all right? So what do we have here? We got some garlic, some basil, some oregano. That's my little Italian uh, spice right there that I call it myself, a little salt and pepper up in it there. It smells so good. Oh, it's awesome. Oh, my God, it's it smells awesome. so good. That's that right there. That smell, what you what you got right there, is your authentic pizza. That's mm -hmm. your pizza taste yeah, that, that you're smelling. That, right that, yeah, right? yeah, absolutely. And then we got pepper. We got pepper. We have a little salt that we're going to put just right a little there. bit. We have about a quarter cup of um, Parmesan cheese okay. and about another quarter cup of mozzarella cheese. Now, we're going to mix all of that in the bowl. Oh, we're going to mix... I'll, 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 I'll take, oh. I'll take okay, care Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But you're actually going to mix the cheese with... Yes. Oh, so, so, that's a binding. so that's how you... That's... You're binding it, you're making your dough, all right? So when it, at the okay. end, you've got a nice crisp shell, if you will. Okay, so then the shell isn't really going to taste like chicken or... Correct. That's so interesting. But now guess what else you're getting out of this? You get the protein, protein. Which is important for us. Boom. Looking Absolutely. at about four servings. Four servings, okay. So you're Perfect. looking at about four servings. So do the math. I'm not good. 10, 10 12 grams of a serving. Okay, that's somewhere right. in there. Now, meaning you're gonna get yourself about four ounces, which is important because of our sleeves. Can't, Small, can't, but it's perfect. Exactly. Though. So we're gonna subdivide this at the end. We're gonna take two chunks out, and we're gonna make ourselves our pizza. So let me, how long will this last in the fridge? This will last, well, you can even go further than the fridge. You can freeze this. Okay. So you can make, you know, this right here again, as you're pulling apart, you got about four servings. So you have four individual personal pan pizzas, if you will. Now, you eat one, you're probably not even going to be able to eat the whole thing. That'll stay in the fridge for your next day or the day after. All right? But the other three crusts, toss them right in the freezer. You got them wow. until you go out the next, throw them right in the microwave, put them in the oven, whatever you want to do, you have a crust already built. So half the battle is out of the way. So okay. again, now this is very simple stuff to do. We're basically going to take all of our condiments, which are, and it doesn't can, matter which... Can you like mix it? I'll, I'll, I'll be like, I'll be the oh, model. You, gonna, I'll be the model. I'll, I'll, I'll be like, I was, like this. I was hoping that I could be a model, you know? Is there any <laughs> connection? You know? right. Okay, so what so, are we doing first? Go ahead and toss in the cheese. This is the mozzarella. Go ahead and toss that in. Go ahead and toss in the, uh, the Parmesan. All right. Yep, there we go. Right. Now I want you to go ahead and toss in all those spices. Let's mix them a little bit. Okay. She's doing a remix right now. She's, she's God, that smells so yes. good. Wait till you smell it coming out of the oven. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I'm, I'm officially hungry. <laughs> now I'm going to take just a small pinch. You don't have to go crazy with salt. We know salt is somewhat the enemy. So small pinch, just get it around there. A little pepper, cracked pepper, just get that all in there. Oh, it smells so good. And now we do. If you guys could be here just to smell this, yes. you'd be like, oh my god, I cannot wait till it's completely done and cooked. And, you and this is just the crust. This is just the crust. Now we have multiple, multiple things that we're going to add to this that you can add. I normally do like a lasagna pie because I love, I told you I'm Garfield, so I, I try to mix everything I can lasagna-wise, whether that's chili, whatever. I always seem to roll right back to the, the same old, same old, which is lasagna. But in our case here, I wanted you to see some veggie. I know you got the green. You're out in there. Oh, yeah. You're out there in Las Vegas, but she's also in California. She's also in New York. She's also in Chicago. She's also... This woman is like Carmen Sandiego. Where in the world is Rosie Ricardo? 
that's really what it should be titled, okay? So we're gonna do a veggie style, all right? And I, I have a little twist on the veggie. We're gonna we're gonna add a little flavor to it because the worst thing you want to do when you have pizza is is bite into a, just a plain Jane mm -hmm. slice of pizza. You want that bite to, to pop. Full of taste. Yes, the flavor. flavor. Really... So when you when you taste that little twist that we put in there, I think it's gonna be hands down your new favorite go-to. Okay, so let that's, me ask... that's my mission, is make this your go-to meal. Go to okay, perfect. Now let me ask you this. Now we just we just put all the ingredients in. Mm -hmm. How long is prep time in the oven? Um in the oven about 15 to 20 minutes. Oh, okay, so it's something one, two, three. So here's okay. what I'm gonna do. This is a small one. I want okay. you to grab the big one? Yep, grab this one. That's I one. keep wanting to pull it. Looks like it's two. Okay, there we go. Now, let's peel back this and that. I'm going to show go. you a little trick here. Where's my little trick? Take this here, the olive oil spray. You're going to spray this down. Now, everyone always asks, Rock, why are you spraying the pan? Okay, that's enough. That's enough. It's not a fire. It's not a fire. It's just stop. But I want to make it nice and even. So, <laughs> so they, I always get the question, why do you put that down? Now, I want you to go ahead and put the parchment paper down. And I want you to just, just smooth it out. Now, okay. that parchment paper isn't going anywhere. Right. Right. That's my little trick. I've seen, I've seen people, I've seen people in the kitchen that put parchment paper down. It slides here, slides there. It's all over the place. This ain't going anywhere. So just for, for that's it. Just, nice just and clean. Stick. That's it. Nice and clean. It's perfect. Right? It's perfect portion size. Exactly. It's really perfect portion size. So I'm gonna dig that out. I'm gonna give you a one. Now, before you pass that over, spray the top of this one. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just okay. a little bit more. That's it. Okay. All right. Now, we're going to take this here. We're just going to leave it there for right now. Okay. Let me have this. We're going to do the same thing over here. Basically, I go ahead and get my hands dirty on the other side. Notice how I keep the model's hands clean and mine all <laughs> you know, caked up and everything. No, no. It's not that. It's that you are a smart woman. A smart woman. A smart man. I'm so sorry. You're a smart man. You understand what needs to be done in the kitchen. So here's, here's, a, here's, here's, the, truth. here's the true thing. Here's the true thing. In the car right here, we're talking, and Rosie says, yeah, you know, I had my manicure yesterday, so boom, I already knew, I'm not getting no, her to dance any chicken, so, that, so I'm a smart dude, all right, so, now, we have the one here, no problem, I'll grab yours, you're going to take your palm, just right on top of it, you want to just kind of give it a little love tap here and there, just a little love tap, kind of like where you want to look at, look like a, a burger, if you will. Okay. All right, so it's there, right? Yeah. So now here's what we're going to do. We're going to take our cookie sheet, the smaller cookie sheet, lay it right on top of it. So go ahead and grab yours, lay it right on top of it. Okay. Now, here's where we're flattening it out. Just going to kind of give it like, pretend that you're doing CPR. Here we go. Give it a little light to this thing. Okay. All right? All so, right. One, two, three. And working the arms out. Exactly. Yeah, get a work out. Yeah. Multitasking over here at the Rock's Kitchen. We get a kitchen workout, we get a eating workout. All right, so now that's flattening it all out. You can go all the way around the sides. Now what I like to do too is I give a little pressure in the middle and I bring it all the way out. That helps the core. Really? Did you just feel that? That was, yeah. the, that was the core. There we go. Am I now, get this right? Let's see. Now the magic moment. Oh, wow. Now the magic moment. Mine's prettier than yours. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> let me see. Let me see. You're like, yours, it's not yours, even. Yours is actually pretty good. It's, it's pretty good. Should I keep going? If, if you, if you it, have a big if, pizza. If, you have a big crust. Yours is pretty good if you have a meatloaf. Oh. <laughs> let's try this again. So just, listen, don't be afraid to, to put pressure down on it. Everywhere that you, you know where it is, just put a little pressure down. There you go. There you go. There you go. That looks. That's it. That looks pretty. We'll go ahead and, I we'll like go. my food to look pretty. She's 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 looking for the look at that. There we go. Wow, wow, wow. All right. So all right. So we got our pizza crust. Now all we're gonna do now, very simple. We wanna stick these bad boys right in the oven. Okay. For about 20 minutes. Now in that 20 minute period, we're gonna slice and dice. And we're gonna talk a little bit. Okay. Perfect. All right. Sounds so good. We'll go ahead and put these in. I already smell the like pizza burning. Oh, no, no. Is it burning? No, no, no. I, I told her she can't come here no. and burn anything. I, I'm supposed to be cooking. So let me no. let me check on this real quick. Oh, my God. Okay, we're, we're actually, we're, we're good. We're, we're good. Okay, we're what are we doing so here? Let's get these What do we have? Tell us. So okay. basically what we're going to do is when we come back, when we come back from our little commercial, which is an instant, um, we're going to end up putting the toppings on us. Okay, right? perfect. And then we're going to stick it back in the oven for the completion. So and then boom, we're going to be able to taste some food. Oh and God, that's what you've been talking about doing. She's been wanting to taste. I want to eat. 
she wants, she wants to eat. All right. Now, now, Rosie, we're going to top these things real quick. Okay. But let me talk about what we did. You know, we, we chopped up some tomatoes. We chopped up some mushrooms. Got broccoli, some bell pepper. Bell, yep, pepper. bell pepper. Bell pepper and some broccoli. Now, here's my little secret ingredient. We're going to toss in some minced garlic. All right. Everyone knows on the kitchen, I'm a garlic guy. So we got about a tablespoon of garlic that we're going to toss in there. Okay. That's my secret ingredient right there. Now, I'm going to go ahead and grab that oregano and more basil, toss that around in there. That smells so good. Mm -hmm. So you've noticed the theme, right? They were cooking with spices, right? Yeah. Now, let me ask you this. This sure. is something we were talking about. There's no um, there's no tomato sauce. There's no... And I love what you brought up because that's really important, especially with sugars. Yeah. So the reason why there's no tomato sauce... Now, don't get me wrong. You can have tomato sauce, but now... I'm all about subtracting. If I don't have to have the tomato sauce and have the four grams of sugar, the six grams of sugar that some of them come with, natural. Natural is always best. So you got you got your tomato, that's your tomato. You chew it, that's your sauce. Saliva and tomato. <laughs> Boom, there you go. <laughs> so let me bring out the pizza dough. Okay. The dough. Okay. Ooh, it's hot to eat. Ooh, wee. Oh, boy. Let me show you. I cannot believe. That that is the pizza crust. Yes. And it has meat in it. it See, is. Look how thin this is. All right. It's awesome. Okay, so how yeah. many calories are we looking at? Looking no, no, at wait, this? wait a minute, because a piece fell off, so. You were supposed to let me eat that. I'm your guest. I, 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 said, a, <laughs> I said a piece fell off. <laughs> cheese in there and whatnot. Now oh you have a, now you so now you a crunchy side. You're going to see where we're a little bit over. You're going to feel that chicken and you're going to feel that dough, if you will. But all the flavors come to life. Yes, absolutely. Oh my God, this is amazing. Absolutely. So, that's what I cheese. Am. Yes, I like to put my cheese down. That way it gets right on the, um, the dough. I like lots of cheese. I don't know about you, but I love cheese. Listen, when, again, when you can... Uh, have less of like the sugar we talked about. Yeah. It gives you room to put a little bit more of something else. It, it has lots of color, which yes. is beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing. That looks so good. You know what I really love? I could really see myself doing this with my kids. Yeah. Listen. I I'm, think it's a fun I'm, way to get vegetables in them too, because a lot of kids growing up don't want to eat. Yes. So this is this is your your Friday night game night, right? This is your you know movie night with the kids. This yeah. is the weekend instead of you know calling up those those uh. You know, restaurants, if mm -hmm. you will. Go in. Listen, it takes it really takes no time. Yeah. At all. Have fun with it. Let them create again. You don't have to just have vegetables. You can put whatever you want on your pizza. So just like you would order, you know, a pepperoni with this, that, and a third. Do the same thing. Just That's substitute so your pepperoni good. for instead of the the fatty one, turkey healthy, pepperoni. And it's a healthy option that you can share with your family. Absolutely. And it's not something. And I also feel like. If you have any gluten allergies, this is something you could replace it, right? Absolutely. Just... Absolutely. This is clean living, and this this is what I love most about eating uh, the kitchen way, the RK way, is that it's clean eating. Oh my she, God, she, this has a lot of fiber she, in it. She, this she, has... just, she just poured all of that. Out I it. did. She Look, just... I want a really full pizza. This is good. This is gonna be my four portions. I get my fiber, get my protein. I get a delicious pizza that's yeah. replacing. All the bread that I can't have because it goes to my hips. Goes, goes to my hips too. <laughs> yeah. Shakira told me hips don't lie. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So now again, we're gonna place these right back in the oven. So let's see what we got going on over here. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. Mm, it looks so pretty. So here's the one. So what I'm going to. Do. If it, can, if it can slide off, it's, it's ready. ready to go. Oh Yay! Again, you have the right tools, you can do anything. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, that's going to be a little hot, so I'll, you know, just be careful. Let's let, let's let it rest. Oh my god, look at that. Oh, this is four meals right here. Yes. Four beautiful, colorful, healthy meals. Right there. You think you can eat pizza? Think again. Moment, moment of truth right here. Moment of truth. You heard the crunch in there. Think of it as a thin crust pizza. Mm. I never have to go back to pizza. This is all I need. Don't put your... Don't, don't, say that again. Mm. 
I never have to go back to pizza. This is all I absolutely need. This is amazing. This tastes so good. My kids can eat this. Yes, this is actually, you know when you go to healthy foods and you're like, this is the oh, alternative, yeah. and you're like, Listen, okay, well, I this is thought, what I can eat. It's I all always right. thought health food was cardboard food. This, this is, is good. far from cardboard food. No, this is really, the taste, all the flavors really come to life. This is really good. I mean, she didn't even get that garlic twist on it yet. She didn't even get that piece yet. She's just taking everything <laughs> from today. Listen, it's okay. I'm not being it's, you, it's okay. You Listen, should know. You're, you're a guest in my home. I, you know, you can have whatever you want. You got the crisp. She got that. I will be coming back in the next couple months. Okay. I'd like to come back. And you know what? I'd love to do a couple more recipes with you. Absolutely. Because this is a great learning experience. And you know what? I'd love to share it with the audience. Not awesome. only that, you had the courage to stand up and speak up in front of it and tell your story. And that's what I absolutely love. And you extended that to an invitation to come and cook with you in your home, in your kitchen. And that is amazing. And you never know how everything comes together. You know, you never know what happens by taking that risk when you'll get a yes. And who cares about the no's? But that yes is coming. And that's all that matters. I thank you. I love you. Thank I you. I appreciate Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming in my kitchen. And listen, she already knows the tag, so I'm going to let her send us off. What is it? Weight loss starts in the kitchen. Weight loss starts in the kitchen. RK, kitchen, peace, Rosie Mercado. Thank you for watching. Yes, thank you for watching. Come back and come back again. And you know what? I promise I'm going to come back in the next couple months and we're going to do something amazing. And we're going to dance. We're going to dance. And that's how... Oh. I can turn. I can... Oh, he... Oh! Hey, listen. You she, are a lucky woman. She don't know. She oh. don't know. No, no. You just taught me. I'm sorry. I just learned something new. <laughs>